at you from the mountains of Northern Virginia again. Um, it was a beautiful day so far. Um, we just had a really, really big thunderstorm, but it didn't last long. Um, I was about to shoot this video and it started pouring. Uh, I don't know about you, but during this time of year, it's like clockwork. Um, it'll be hot and sunny all day, and then come four o'clock or so, it pours. <laughs> no fail. Um, but yeah, anyways, uh, today I'm doing a video about some pots that I got at Hobby Lobby. Um, it's a great day. It's a great day for a video. Um, I'm super, super excited about what I got from Hobby Lobby on sale. I got all of these half price, um, not the plants, the pottery, but do you hear that thunder? <laughs> um, it let up, but I don't know. Maybe it'll start again. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I got all the pottery, um, not the plants. Uh, these are my plants. I put them in here just to kind of give you guys an idea of what some might look like get some ideas um and except for this little cement pot you may have seen this in another video of mine um I just wanted to use this plant to show you what I was using this for um this I believe is a candle stand I'm not sure but it was actually on clearance and when I have a lot of little um lots of little short plants in pots I sometimes feel like next to a big huge pot they need to stand up a little bit so i got these i don't know but they were super cheap um i got all these pots here for 45 dollars, and i'm super excited about that um these are huge pots this is a heavy duty pot and these were on clearance but I don't know. I'm just super excited. I wanted to let you guys know what kind of uh, great things you could find uh, at Hobby Lobby when they go on sale for half price. Um, I already had one of these, but I really like it. It's some sort of clay. I don't know. I got my plant stuck in there. Um, but this one actually already has a drainage hole. I have a Peperomia in it right now. Um, my other one, uh, I have a Ruby Glow and um, modeling the pot today. Here is my Ruby Cascade Peperomia. <laughs> yeah, um, if you can't tell, I like Pylea Peperomioides or however you say it. Um, I always sound, or I always feel super silly saying that. I don't know if I'm saying it right. My husband probably thinks I'm crazy. Um, all these crazy plant names I'm always talking about. Um, and then this one over here, it has a little detail around the bottom I really like. Um, no drainage hole. Whoop, does it have a drainage hole? No, no drainage hole. It has little pads on the bottom. Um, and modeling this pot, I have my Tritiscantia Zabrina here. Um, these are actually cuttings I took from the big plant and they're already growing pretty big. I think I'm gonna be gifting that to someone. Um, I don't have too much light in my apartment and I have a lot of plants so I, I don't have room for any of them to be gigantic if they need a lot of light like that. So yeah, um, and then I got this little guy. I I've had my eye on this for a while. Um, it's a, uh, I'm gonna use it for propagation station. I think it's super cute. Adds a little bit of color to my like neutral, uh, not pattern, my neutral, I don't know. <laughs> um. And then this little guy, it's not a pot. Um, I could use it for a propagation pot. I'm pretty sure I will if I ever propagate something a little bigger, like maybe my Rufinophora. Uh, Tetrasperma, I'm probably gonna have to cut him up soon. Oh my gosh, that sounded so horrible. I don't wanna do it. 
Um, and then I really like this little guy. And so like this was originally $5.99. So I got this for two or two seventy five. Is that how that math works? I don't know. Anyways, um, half of five ninety nine for this. Isn't it adorable? I love it so much. I think I actually want to put a fairy fairy tale cactus. Sorry, I can't think today. Um, I had my coffee long ago, and I've been running errands all morning. So bear with me. But yeah, I think I want to put my uh, fairy tale cactus in this I think it would look cute but right now I have a little pepperomioides baby in there modeling that uh this actually uh wasn't a, a candle holder or a stand or anything it's actually a container which I really like I don't know yet if I'm gonna use it for a plant stand or a container um I have these little glasses wipes like these little individual packs that I like to keep in the living room but I didn't want to keep the box out there I thought it might look tacky and not put together messy not tacky messy might look a little messy um I don't like to leave things kind of sitting out I like to have nice containers for them it just helps me feel like everything's organized I guess and when you live in a small apartment, um, it's appreciated. Uh, I don't know if you guys got a good look at this pot, but I really love it. Um, it's super heavy duty and oh, I love it so much. How much was this one? $17.99. It's a more expensive one, but it's big and it's heavy duty and I love it. It was worth it. Like if I can get all the, all this for $45, I think it's a win. I, granted, I could have instead of buying these uh, vases or this little propagation vase, um, I could have bought some more pots. You know, instead of buying these, I could have bought some more pots, but I don't know, I feel like um, I just really like them. So that's what I went with today. Uh, if, I, if I would have found more pots that caught my eye, I definitely would grab them. But as for now, I think this is pretty good. Uh, I don't have a lot of plants right now that I need to pot, uh, but like, like you may remember me saying before, I buy pots when they're on sale that I like, and then whenever the right plant comes along, um, or maybe I already have the plant, then, sorry, it's thunder again, then I'll use it and I'll have it. But yeah, pretty short video. Uh, I just wanted to kind of let you all in on the deals that I look for and find. I hope that you find some great deals and I hope that it's nice and sunny where you're at or if you like the rain, I hope you get a thunderstorm during the day at some point. But anyways, uh, thank you all for tuning in and have a great day. Uh -huh.